Hey everyone, this is Logan from Lucky Trader here to do a quick tutorial on how to edit gas settings within MetaMask. So if you're in the NFT space, you might recognize that at certain times, uh, there is a lot of demand for a given project. Parallel Alpha happens to be a project that is very well respected and sometimes will drive large demand to particular assets. From time to time, it's going to be required that in order for us to beat others to getting a particular asset, whether that be through minting an NFT project or buying something from OpenSea, we're going to need to edit our gas settings to try and push through our transactions with higher fees so that they are verified on the blockchain by miners uh, more quickly than others who may be sending with less of a gas fee. So I'm going to show you really quickly in the process of purchasing an NFT, how I might be able to go about editing the gas fee. So first and foremost, I'm going to find what I might need to buy. Again, this may be happening through a direct site uh, where you'd be looking to mint. I'm going to go to buy now. And I'm going to start creating my transaction by hitting check out on this solar grenade. And once I've done so, you'll notice that I have a suggested gas fee via MetaMask based on the demand on the Ethereum blockchain. This demand is automatically calculated for you, and it is, uh, it is MetaMask's best estimation based on the demand that is currently happening. Sometimes it's going to be higher if the Ethereum network is very congested. Other times it'll be lower, and this, variation, this will vary based on the type of transaction that you're doing. So sending, this, um, to, sending Ethereum to a different address requires a little bit less gas. It's less intensive of a transaction type than perhaps minting or interacting with a contract like we're going to be doing right now to be able to make an NFT purchase. So first and foremost, you could, if you were in no rush, you could just merely accept not mean that the fee that you see before you will be the actual fee. You notice a max fee option right here. Um, it just means that this is their estimation, but it's very likely that it could be the case that it is actually cheaper than what you see listed on the screen. However, if we want to edit this, because we, we definitely want to be able to make sure that this gets pushed through before someone else does, we'll simply hit edit. And you'll notice you have three default options prioritized by MetaMask. There is a low, a medium, and a high priority. Low priority is best used when you have no uh, immediate need for this transaction to go through and you don't believe that you're competing in any way. So we typically reserve this if you're just trying to send transactions to a different wallet or to a friend and you have no need for it to get there very, very quickly. Medium in this instance, again, not going to be something that we would look to utilize if we're trying to beat others to purchasing an asset or to minting an NFT. However, it's going to give us about the average gas fee for the present time. High on the other end is going to to give us a, a, a chance at potentially beating others uh, to a transaction should they be typically operating with just the average gas fee or a lower gas fee setting um, based on the demand on the Ethereum blockchain. While you could look to utilize these defaults, there is another way that we can edit using the advanced options within the MetaMask uh, wallet. So these three options here, you have little tool tips that are going to give you an uh, idea of exactly what they are. And please refer to our MetaMask guide on LuckyTrader.com for further explanation. However, you can come in here and you can change these options, your gas limit, your max priority fee. This is essentially your minor tip or the maximum fee, which is going to be the priority fee plus the gas fee, um, to be able to increase the potential gas uh, that you would be sending through with this transaction to ensure that your transaction gets through before others. So you can manually edit this if I wanted to make this 250 as my max fee. You'll notice the U.S. dollar calculation aside as well. I could enter a max um a max priority fee if I wish to give the miners an incentive to pick up my transaction before others, uh, or you could edit your gas limit as well. Again, MetaMask will have some options for you about how you should choose. We'll have those same breakdowns on LuckyTrader.com in our guide to MetaMask, um, but these are the ways that you can simply 
edit your gas settings to be able to push through transactions in a quicker manner should you need to on OpenSea or uh, whatever decentralized application you may be um, accessing or utilizing at present time. This is a bit more advanced. It is highly, highly advised that you do this a few times with small amounts just to get the feel down for when it might become more of a priority in terms of time. Um, but it's as simple as clicking edit and then moving and uh, operating based on your needs and based on your goals for the particular action at hand. Thanks and have a great day.